All right, we're on a mission. Today's mission to find the freshest crab bait that we can find. And to uh, find the freshest crab bait, gotta go to the Asian markets. There's none by where I live, uh, but there's one stone's throw away from my office, and I think they're gonna have what I'm looking for. Meat department. Seafood department, fresh shrimp, fish, looking for the squid, aha, bingo, a couple handfuls of this and uh, should last me about four or five outings. Well, they didn't have any raw anchovies, uh, but they do have frozen sardines and small anchovies. I'm going to go with the big sardines because they should stay intact a little better. It'll be harder for the crab to pick through through our little cages. We got our sardines. I got our uh, squid. I think we got everything we need to uh, slay some Dungeness crab tomorrow. I mean, I guess I could buy uh, Dungeness crab right here and not catch them. But what would the fun be in that? Yeah, way right there. All right, I made it out to Pacific Pier. Got here at about five in the morning. Kind of scared about being uh, caught up in the waves on a beach. So came to the pier. Never been here at the beginning of the season, and um, freaking crowded, man. It was crazy. It's like Guggen Central. Every every Guggen within 100 miles is on this pier right now. It's amazing but uh, no catches yet. I think we're at the very beginning of outgoing tide and the swells are pretty big. I don't know if you can tell. Hoping that the bike turns on when the, uh, in between the, uh, all the big sets. So, we'll see. So I was with these guys uh, for a few hours this morning and they were here at one. One in the morning. One in the morning with opening day. Opening day with uh, everyone in Pacifica it seems like. Yeah. Yep. So, uh, any luck this morning since you've been no. here? It's about not, six o'clock. No luck. Yeah. No luck. But people have been pulling up crabs, right? Yes. Okay. So we're at the uh, turn of the tide. So unfortunately, this guy has to go because of work, right? Yes. But uh, maybe the, the bite will turn on, and uh, I guess you're gonna have to find my video and see if uh, people around you yeah. caught anything. <laughs> yes. All right. Well, nice to meet you. Yeah. Good luck good for luck. the rest of the season. I'm sure I'll see you guys yeah. around. Okay. Yeah. Take it easy. Yeah. Bye, guys. Bye. Nope. I didn't see how many people I I snag along the way. Nothing. Rough day. I'm gonna wrap up and uh, head on home. Any luck today? Pretty tough. Okay. I'm at the Half Moon Bay Jetty, looking for a little redemption. Got shut out big time at the pier and uh, out here to see if a different location produces any crab. Not just bigger and better crab, just any crab. So let's see if we have any luck at the, the Half Moon Bay South Jetty. Parkour. Parkour. All right, rigged up my first trap. Got a combination of sardines and squid. I'm about mm, a third, not even halfway down the south half wing bay jetty. Don't want to go too far because I gotta go get out of here. I'm only here for a couple hours, so I'm gonna give this spot a shot and uh, wish me luck. First cast.
damages. Yeah, not too much activity. All right, we're freshening our, our bait box since uh, some of the bait's deteriorating out of our snare here. And when it's quiet like this, I have a suspicion that the snares uh, need more broadcast bait. When uh, the fish is gone, that's normally indicative of a lot of uh, creatures in the sand eating it or crabs picking through it. Um, and I think to get the crab's attention, we're gonna have to uh, put a lot more broadcast bait. So let's throw in some more sardine and see if we have any luck. All right, repack the bait box with a uh, fresh anchovy head and, uh, and a nice fat midsection with all the guts. So you could say the snare is uh, stuffed to the gills. So let's see if this uh, stink, stink sardine broadcast scent far and wide and and attracts enough crab to come and, and, and work on it and then work on the uh, squid and keeps them there long enough for me to uh, pull and entrap. All right, about to pull the snare that uh, I rebaited with a fish head and some uh, fish guts. So it's been another 20. Let's see if I have any luck here with this pull. Got it. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, shoot. Oh, son. All right. Don't want to lose him on the rock. Yeah! Oh. Sun! Woo! <sighs> Rebaited it. Rebaited Krabby. That might be it. <sighs> On the fish head. Alright. Scale, let's see if he's big enough. Dude, this guy's pretty heavy. Nice male, one claw. Let's see if he's the first keeper of the season. Inside the points, the inside of the point, not the points themselves, right? So let's go across this way. Ding, ding, ding. First keeper. Hell yeah. See, if uh, that point was short of this little tab right here, I'd have to toss him back, but he's coming home with me. Woo. <sighs> on the rebated, on the rebated snare. Only got one claw, but I'll take it. Hell yeah. <sighs> Dunk like that should keep this crab happy for, I don't know, for an hour or so. It's amazing how much oxygen they'll burn up though in this water, so what I'm gonna do is, before I leave, I'm gonna dump this water out Walk down the jetty, when I get to the end, I'm gonna replace uh, whatever water's left over with fresh water for the drive home. Another tip, if you have uh, bait laying around, don't let it lay around too long, because one, a bird will pick it off, and two, it serves you much better if you put it back in your, in your bag with the rest of your bait, because you want to keep that bait marinated and, and stinky. Final pull here, there we go. Nothing. I think that guy caught my crabs. About that time I take off, so really stoked I got my first crab this season. That's more than enough uh, dinner and uh, crab for one. Till next time guys, I'll see you on the pier and maybe on the jetty and somewhere on the shore. I'm out. Rechargeable, right? Rechargeable, yeah. I got two of them. One lasts about an hour, maybe an hour and a half. Yeah. The, uh, the best part is it's, it's waterproof, so if you dropped it in the water, it'd be okay. Yeah. Yeah, it's a GoPro. Yeah. Are you all done? You're, you're going to go home? Yeah. You all done? <laughs> all right. <laughs> yeah. Not to good luck? Okay. All right. I'll see you next time. <laughs> Thanks, man. <laughs>